After he done cursed him now, he know he think it's God. He used to his God work. Come to me, I'll give thy flesh into the fires of the air and the beasts of the field. Keep going. Then said David to the Philistine, Thou comest with, to me with a sword and with a spear and with a shield. You come in the curses with your sword and spear, but I come in the name of the Lord of hosts. Everybody say hosts. Hosts. Host. The word host there, amen, means the Lord of the army of light. Lord Sabaoth, the God of the armies of Israel, whom thou hast defied, this day will the Lord deliver thee into my hand. Who's going to do the delivery? The Lord. Who is going to do the delivering against him? It was going to be the devil. Now, <clears throat> who's going to deliver him into his hand? And I will smite thee and take thine head from thee and I will give the carcasses of the hosts of the Philistines this day unto the fowls of the air and to the wild beasts of the earth that all the earth may know there is a God in Israel. And all this assembly shall know. Keep going. That the Lord uh, save it not with sword and spear for the battle is the Lord's and he will give into our hands. We just found out he was executing vengeance. David didn't say he was going to do this to him. He said, the Lord is going to deliver you to me. Vengeance is not ours. It's not flesh. But God's. Father, we thank you. And we praise you for your goodness. We thank you for your mercy. We thank you for victory in you. We thank you for a time of advance. We thank you for a time of change of story, Father God. We thank you. Hallelujah. Where there have been few, there shall be many. Father God, your word will go forth with free course. Nothing will hinder it. We give you praise. We give you glory that we are more than conquerors through him who loves. We pray this prayer. In Jesus' name. Let me get your strongest amen. 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 amen.